Hugh Jackman plays entrepreneur P.T. Barnum as he creates the famous Barnum and Bailey Circus in what shapes is a colorful, feel-good musical. A longest dating project in Hollywood, it is directed by Australian Michael Gracie, whose background is in visual effects and commercials. He has assembled a strong cast around the charismatic Jackman including Zac Efron, Michelle Williams, Rebecca Ferguson and Zendaya, with music from Benj Pasek and Justin Paul, who won an Oscar with Justin Hurwitz for La La Land this year. December 26, Coco Pixar Animation Studios delivers yet again with a vibrant comic celebration of Mexican culture. Directed by Lee Unkirk Finding Nemo, Toy Story 2 and 3 and screenwriter Adrian Molina, Coco centers on 12-year-old Miguel voiced by Anthony Gonzalez whose quest to play the guitar like his hero, despite his family's long-time opposition, sees him trapped in the land of the dead. It is another animated triumph from a studio that is known for animated triumphs, Forbes declared. December 26, Downsizing After Election, Sideways, The Descendants in Nebraska, any new movie from Alexander Payne commands attention, especially when it has a fun premise that will appeal to anyone stressed about the housing market in Sydney. After scientists discover how to shrink people as a solution to overpopulation, a couple played by Matt Damon and Kristen Wiig abandon their stressed lives to move into a tiny community. When it debuted at the Venice Film Festival, The Guardian called the movie a gorgeous, giddy parable of a modern-day Lilliput. December 2 6 THREE Billboards Outside Ebbing, Missouri references McDormand is at her sassy best as a mother who rents three billboards attacking a police chief's failure to solve her daughter's murder. Woody Harrelson plays her nemesis in this dark comic drama written and directed by Martin McDonough, the former playwright who has made his name within Bruges then followed up with Seven Psychopaths. It's considered a likely Best Picture nominee at the Oscars. January 1 THE Post Steven Spielberg tackles the Pentagon Papers scandal in a movie that could hardly be more timely. Meryl Streep plays the Washington Post's trailblazing publisher Catherine Graham and Tom Hanks editor Ben Bradley in a drama about how they both risked their careers, and a lot more, to expose a massive government cover-up of secrets about the Vietnam War. In an America where the freedom of the press is being challenged daily, Spielberg fast-tracked the movie, saying, This was a story that I really felt we needed to tell today. January 1 1 THE Shape of Water Mexico's Guillermo del Toro Pan's Labyrinth has been winning stellar reviews for a dark-edged romantic fairy tale set during the Cold War. A lonely worker in a government aerospace research facility Sally Hawkins bonds with an amphibious creature in a film expected to feature strongly at the Oscars. The Hollywood Reporter called it a visually and emotionally ravishing fantasy that should find a welcome embrace from audiences starved for imaginative escape. January 1 8 SWEET Country After Samson and Delilah, another landmark Australian film from director Warwick Thornton, a western set in the Northern Territory in the 1920s. Haunting for its beauty and brutality, it is based on a real-life story about an Aboriginal stockman non-professional actor Hamilton Morris who goes on the run with his wife Natasia Goreferber, also non-professional after killing a white station owner Ewan Leslie in self-defense. There are also impressive performances from Brian Brown, Sam Neill and Matt Day. January 25th I, Tanya Margot Robbie plays feisty figure skater Tanya Harding in a wickedly comic account of one of sports' craziest scandals, an ill-conceived plan to cripple rival Nancy Kerrigan. Caitlin Carver so she could not compete at the 1994 Winter Olympics. Directed by Australian Craig Gillespie Larson The Real Girl, The Finest Hours, it has Sebastian Stan as her impetuous ex-husband, but the real stars of the rink are Robbie, who proves how good an actress she is, and Alison Janney as Harding's monstrous mother. February 15th